hey mermaids if you like what you hear please subscribe it will encourage me to create more content for you and also check out my instagram and reddit hey handsome wait why are you looking so sad all of a sudden please tell me you aren't missing your friends and family again you know they never really appreciated you and i don't see why you would need anyone else when you have oh it's not that <laughs> good i'm glad because they didn't deserve you anyway so what is it then you are feeling insecure why oh no i don't mean to minimize your feelings or anything i just don't get it you are perfect nobody is perfect the person who said that obviously never met you you are perfect hey don't talk like that no one is allowed to insult my soulmate not even my soulmate Honestly how could you think that about yourself did someone tell you that oh i'm sorry but literally all of society is a little vague i need names addresses if you have them really any sort of identifying information what don't look at me like that You know I promised not to kill anyone else unless I had a really good reason. So you have nothing to worry about. Just tell me their names and I will make it better. Really? You are sure no one said anything to you? This is all coming from your own head. Ah, I see. I just don't understand why. I mean You know how much I love you, right? You know I would die for you. You know I would kill for you. I've killed for you. You know I want to keep you all to myself forever and ever and ever and <clears throat> Anyway, do you think I would do all that for just anyone? What do you mean that's not really about me? Of course it's about you. Everything is about you. My whole life, my whole world. everything you you think i imprinted on you what like a duckling well yes my initial attraction toward you was sudden and powerful incredible and you were the most beautiful person i ever seen but the more i watched you the more things i fell in love with if you weren't you I wouldn't feel this way. I wouldn't need you the way I do. Darling, trust me. I'm not the only person who's ever felt this way about you. So many people wanted you. You were just so sweet and innocent, and you have always been so hard on yourself. So you couldn't see it. That's why I had to take you away. And no, I'm not just jealous. I mean, maybe a little but that's a totally normal reaction when someone tries to steal something that's mine which you are all mine what do i have to do to prove to you that you are perfect and you have nothing to feel insecure about i could get a picture of you tattooed on me or i could slash the tires of that guy who was mean to you back in middle school or I could buy you something precious and one of a kind just like you are. Oh, what if I show you the shrine I made for you? I know you had that panic attack the first time you saw it, but to be fair, you were having a really overwhelming day. I'm not sure if you took in all the details. I was so careful when putting it together and I think it really shows how much I adore every little aspect of you. The feel of your hair, the way you chew your food, the clothes you wear, 
of you write your name <laughs> sorry mm, got carried away there would any of that help no what can i do then and before you say it letting you go is not an option wait what you would feel even more insecure if i let you go because at least i want you oh darling of course i want you i need you only you always you <laughs> you like the attention i give you ha huh? the way i look at you the compliments the way i keep you all to myself well i'm glad you were settling in a little worried about you i guess but mostly glad you know i would never leave you right no matter what you say or do no matter how much you weigh or how old you get no matter how much you beg me to go i will never ever leave you <laughs>